What's good, YouTube? Lavari, and I'm back with another banger NBA 2K24 video. You know what I'm saying? I almost said 23. I don't know why. But I got y'all with another build video. It's been a while since I posted a build video. Um, this build right here, this is my mid range threat, 6 foot 11. This build is what I'm using for my no money spent uh, grind. You know what I'm saying? 60 to 99 overall, which I'm currently live streaming right now on my YouTube. Make sure you definitely check that out because this is a hard grind. I'm doing this build and I'm grinding it with no teammates, okay? I'm playing random wreck. Y'all know how it gets in random wreck. Come on, hit that for me. Oh my God, these niggas suck. It gets, it gets hard up in there. Now, before I even show y'all this build, before I get into this, let me just let y'all know, not every build is meant for everyone, okay? If this build seems like a good build for you, then try it out. But trust me, it's a good build in general. It might not be for you because I sacrificed some stuff. Sometimes you gotta sacrifice stuff to get other stuff. You know what I'm saying? That's how it is in 2K. You can't have all the things you want how you want it. Sometimes you gotta lower some stuff so you can get something else you want. Let's get right into this. I'm not even gonna waste y'all time too much. First things first, like I said, six foot eleven center. The way I get this center now, okay. This I'm gonna just let you know right now. This center do not get ninety strength, okay. It do not get gold brick wall. I sacrifice that because I know that now I'm, I, I'll be fine with a silver. Me personally, I'm fine with the silver brick wall. So I went two hundred thirty one pounds. That's the lowest you can go for silver brick wall. I put seven foot nine maximum wingspan. You feel me? Now, close shot. That is on seventy. We're not really going to be doing nothing like that for real. We rocking with the standard dunk, which I got at a 92. And I got at a 92, we get that gold fast twitch. You know what I'm saying? Get the gold rise up, gold area wizard, and gold precision dunk. You feel me? We don't have a high driving dunk. As y'all know, driving dunk me the fucking ass in this game. I took a long break from this game, came back, and they still ain't fixed the driving dunk meter. I don't know what is going on. Why is it not fixed? Why? 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 This is supposed to be a good year for dunk meter. I don't know what the hell is going on with that shit. But whatever, you know what I'm saying? We got a 53 driving layup, 73 driving dunk. We got the 92 standing dunk. Now, when I say you got to sacrifice, people, some people want a high close shot. But for me to get everything else I got on this build, can't get everything high. That's just how it is, you feel me? We got an 82 midi. That gives us gold catch and shoot. You know what I'm saying? We got bronze dead eye. We get the silver green machine, all right? We also get gold guard up, gold comeback kit, silver mini magician, and silver open looks. Now, these are all good badges. These are good badges, good tiers. These are perfectly fine for people who making shooting bigs. You know what I'm saying? We're not making no dribble dribble head centers. You know what I'm saying? We're not a point guard. We don't need to get too crazy with the with the shooting badges, too crazy with the shooting raiders. You know what I'm saying? We got a 76-3. You can hit with a 76-3. If you still can't hit with a 76-3, I don't know what to tell you. You get a 76 three pointer with the badges that I listed, you'll be fine with shooting, okay? Shooting is no problem. We do got an 81 free throw. Those were like extra points. It was really like a 70 something, but I had extra points at the end. But this 70, this 81 free throw do gives you silver free points. So you are gonna hit more free throws in the clutch. Now, one thing I really wanted to talk about real quick is pass accuracy. Pass accuracy, I made a video a long time ago saying 86 and 92 was worthless. They are, kinda. You can do fine. Now, here's my, let me, matter of fact, let me tell you my sweet spots. My sweet spots for pass accuracy. These are the only three pass accuracies that make sense to me. If you don't want to go high pass at all, you want to go low, the lowest I would say is 76, okay? 76. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, 76 is for the bronze needle threader. If it's not that, it's something else. But it's, a, it's, a, it's, it's good enough. You make your passes. It's a good enough pass accuracy. I have bills that only got a 76. And you make your outlet passes, you make your regular passes, it's fast enough, it's good enough, you'll be just fine. If you don't want to go that low, 76, the next sweet spot is 86, which is what I got on this build. You know what I'm saying? That's gold break starter, silver needle threader, silver diamond. You know what I'm saying? You get some good badges with that 86. Some people want to go 92. And I do have a build with a 92. You know what I'm saying? I got a Jokic build, 92, pass accuracy. That go crazy too. That go crazy too. Don't get me wrong, that dude go crazy. But it's not needed though. You do not need it. You can go 76, 86, or 92. Those are my three sweet spots. I've tested all of them. They all work perfectly fine. Anybody tell you differently, like you must have 92, you must have this. No, you can use any of those three. Trust and believe. Trust me. We got a 60 bar handle, um, 41 steel bar that gives us 
big driver on Browns, you know what I'm saying? Even though we're not really going to be driving like that, but it's sometimes you might got a little baby on you while you go into the paint. You might want to get that, you know what I'm saying? We got 75 interior. Now, listen, I know people are going to get on my ass for this. I have been using a Pro M build, okay, for a long time that had a 78 block and like a, a lower interior defense. The stops and the blocks that I still get with these low attributes are insane. This is something I decided I wanted to sacrifice on this build because I wanted to get other stats such as high shooting, high pass, high standing dunk. As you can see in the bottom, I got high speed and a decent strength and an 80 vertical, you know what I'm saying? You can do fine. If you're good at the game, you know what you're doing, you're not a rookie, this is perfectly fine. That's why I say if this is not for you, then it's not for you. But this this can work for people who are good at the game, okay? Bronze Anchor works perfectly fine. Yes, it makes sense to get a silver gold Hall of Fame anchor. But if you know what you're doing, you know how to time your blocks, you know how to move up the, the, the proper way to get into position for defensive plays in the paint, you will be fine with a 75 interior defense, 78 block, all right? We got 68 still. <coughs> <coughs> I was going to try to push for a 70, but we just got a 68. Once again, I added extra points at the end. No specific reason for the 68, but that's good enough to get your pass lane steals. You feel me? You'll definitely get a lot of pass lane steals with a 68. 42 perimeter defense. Hey, as a center, as long as you know how to play good perimeter D, you know how to use the hands up D at the right time, you know how to move your center, you'll be fine with a low perimeter defense, okay? It's just, it's just fast. If you don't believe me, you can pop into my streams, okay? If you don't believe me, you think I'm just capping or I'm just saying shit just to say shit and I don't know what I'm talking about, trust me, I've been playing 2K since 2K11, okay? I'm only, I'm not old here. Don't, don't call me unk. I'm not an old head. But I've been playing 2K since NBA 2K11. And I've been heavily playing 2K. 2K has been something I've played year round, okay? So I know what I'm talking about. I play these games, okay? Um, We do got 80 offensive rebound. This is something that I said we had to sacrifice, you know what I'm saying? Now, most people would say go higher offensive than defensive. And you can very much try that. You can very much do that. Me personally, I didn't want to do that because I feel like offensively, I already get, I get in the good position for offensive rebounds. I don't even need that. This is for a wreck, okay? This build is for a wreck. This ain't, this ain't a pro am build. This ain't a park build. This is for a wreck. And I, and I specifically play wreck with randoms, okay? Wreck with randoms. I'm just fine with an 80 offensive, 92 defensive. I know the box out beast is only a silver. I know. I know. I know. I should have went up to get an 84. Um, actually, I think I did. I don't think this is the right build. I think I did. I um, I went up on the strength for the 84 strength so I can get the gold box out beast. You know what I'm saying? Um, and of course we got the gold pogo stick, the gold rebound chaser. Um, but the big kicker about this 611 is the speed. You know what I'm saying? 72 speed. You faster than the other centers. You feel me? You got some speed on you. You can do so much more than these other centers. I promise you. Speed kills, okay? Speed is a mother effer. All right? 57 celebration, you know what I'm saying? I was going to try to get it up higher, but like I said, you got to sacrifice to get certain other attributes. You feel me? Um, 83 strength. Again, I sacrificed that gold brick wall. I sacrificed that 90 strength. Everybody in their mama used 90 strength. Me, personally, I know I'm fine with a silver brick wall. You will be fine with a silver. It's okay. So a lot of people don't even have pick pick dodger, bro. We're in the, you're playing if you're playing wreck. A lot of people do not have pick dodger, bro. I'm telling you. You know how I many people I've went into the wreck. First of all, I've been using this build on my no money spent. It's a 66 overall, and he's already setting good screens. And I don't even have my damn badges up. I don't even got my strength up yet. My strength's still like a 60 something or whatever the fuck it is. I don't know. But we got an 80 vertical. You know what I'm saying? That gives us silver chase down. You feel me? Silver chase down is a motherfucker. That's good enough. You don't need gold. You don't need Hall of Fame. You'll do fine with the silver. We also got bronze posterizer too, by the way. Um, I don't really expect to be getting too many contacts. We'll get a lot of contact standard dunks, though. If you got to get that gold rise up, you know what I'm saying? Just make sure you get the animations for it, you know what I'm saying? And then we got 95 stamina. Now, like I said, this build is not for everyone. You know what I'm saying? I was a little bit hesitant making this build, but because it's, a, it's my no money spent build, it's my no money spent build. So I was like, I'm not about to waste no money on it, so why not give it a shot? And so far, literally in my second game on a 66 overall, I got 25 rebounds, bro. On a 90 overall center. Against a 90 overall, I got 25 rebounds. I mean, that's just because skill. Anybody who's not good at the game, do not listen to that, okay? If you know you're a rookie, you know you need some practice, you know you need to work on your game first. And there's nothing wrong with that, by the way. 
but do not try that, okay? You cannot, it's not, not everybody can get 25 rebounds on a 60 overall, okay? That's just not, that's just not, that's just not common. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, I got experience. I've been playing this shit for a brick. You know what I'm saying? But anyways, let me know if you like the video. Make sure you sub up. Make sure you leave a comment. I will read all comments. I always read all comments. You know what I'm saying? I give you a heart. If you want a heart from your boy, I got you. You know what I'm saying? But I appreciate you for watching this video. And I'm out, bro. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.